Hi guys, welcome back to another Itch.io free-to-play walkthrough. Today we have Verona Cold Warfare. It's supposed to be a rhythm-based like plot game with three romance uh, people that we're going to try to romance them all because that's what we do. As always, I'll leave a link to the game in the description if you want to try it for yourself. And if you like the video, please like and subscribe. It helps the channel grow and I always appreciate it and you. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Okay. I like the music so far. This flute's going so hard. In 1943, the U.S. Army's Signal Intelligence Service began a secret Soviet code-breaking program that would come to be known as Verona. This small and secretive program, purportedly unknown even to President Truman, was able to exploit a fatal flaw in the Soviet's one-time paid pad cipher, cipher system. While one-time pad ciphers are theoretically unbreakable, the Soviets had produced duplicate pads in 1942 that were used as late as 1948. This is too much history. Making encoded messages susceptible to cryptanalysis. Verona is well known for his contribution to its identifying Julius and Ethel Rosenberg, who were infamously executed for providing nuclear secrets to Soviet Russia amid the toxic McCarthyism of the 1950s and 60s. The crypt analytic team, working on the tough analytic math required to decrypt these messages, was largely compromised, comprised of young women who, during chaos and paranoia to come, were among the very few Americans who knew the truth. Keeping these secrets wasn't what wasn't always easy. Grammar's good so far. That's good. All right. Let's see what we got next. We had some banging flute. She got some big ol' eyeballs, son. What the hell? Another day spent counting nickels and inhaling nail polish perfumes. Peachy. Frankie, can you bring in the newspapers like a deer and please turn off the racket? Ah, uh, not to mention getting bossed around by my s- Oh, that was your sister? Okay. <laughs> by my sisters all day. I already brought the papers in, dearest Alice, and this isn't a racket. It's my favorite new record. You should be glad I brought my phonograph here in the first place. It's giving Miss Crabley an allergic reaction. Shut it off. What a bore. Oh, she's big mad. Now that the war's over, there isn't much work for single women. But surely there must be something to get me out of Nowheresville, P Pennsylvania. Hot dog. Hot dog. Are you okay, Frankie? Yes, I'm perfectly fine. More than fine. I see a way out. Wanted. Candidate strong in mathematics. Must be able to relocate to Washington, D.C. A little vague, but I must try. I simply must. Oh, Lord. Yeah. Here I am, the big city. If this test goes well, maybe I'll be able to stay. Then again, there are quite a few educated women here, and I've never been to college. Come along now, ladies. We're about to begin the test. Though it might look like a random set of numbers, you will be provided with an encoded message. Your task is to decode it. Usually, I like to listen to records while I bounce the books back at home. But... I suppose I'll just have to figure out these out to my own rhythm. Oh, I'm ready. I love rhythm games. I'm not great at them, but I love them. How do I play? QW123? What the hell? Uh, keep the rhythm by coding, going by pressing 123QW when the collar pieces overlap with their corresponding spots on the wheel. The pieces will overlap with the beat of the music. As you progress, the encoded message will be revealed. Be careful, five incorrect, and you will need to try again. I am not ready. That sounds so confusing. Uh, well, we'll fail and then we'll figure it out, hopefully. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, do I have to click it? Oh, okay. Okay, we're doing it. Am I doing it right? I think I'm off by like a second. Am I supposed to be reading this in the top left while I'm doing this? Because I can't. Oh, well, this is kind of easy. It's like a bop it machine, but with rhythm. Rhythm bop it. Twist it. Spake it. Slap it. Squeeze it. Wait. Maybe, hopefully the message will stay after I win this so I can actually read it myself. Because I can't do both. I could try. Something, something Soviets. Something, something. You may just decoded your first message by the Soviets, apparently. Maybe. 
This, it's got a pretty nice room for error. It's pretty hard to miss it, I guess. Because I feel like I've been a little bit off each time. I wish it had uh, like a good, perfect, okay, you suck. Wow, what are you doing? Why aren't you hitting this at the right time? What is wrong with you? Your family must be so disappointed in your bad rhythm skills. You know, all the important things it's supposed to say. Okay, congratulations. You have just decoded your first secret message. You must think you're pretty smart. Wait until you see what the Soviets have in store. You have decoded the message. Continue. Oh, I'm the chosen one. Congratulations. You were the first girl by far to decode the message. I will be recommending you for our Russian code-breaking project. Thank you so much. I guess I'm here to stay. Oh. Her eyes are freaking huge, boy. Oh, this is where I get to pick my love. Who just tapped on your shoulder? Alright, so there seems to be three guys. We'll do guy, girl, guy. Uh, what about this strapping lad with the straps? <laughs> Pardon me, you dropped your scarf. And a very nice one it is, I must my dad. Oh god, he's Russian? How handsome, and his accent is freight, but I think he must be Russian. Oh, thank you. I'm so clumsy. The klutz of my family. My sister Alice would always claim whatever I dropped. She called it Finder Keepers. I am tempted to do the same, but I don't know how to do a Russian accent. If it meant I'd get to see you again. I am quite attached. I don't know how to do a Russian accent at all. Ha <laughs> I'm quite attached to that scarf. Hmm. No, it wouldn't be right to leave a beautiful young lady scarfless on a windy day. But even though I've lost my bargaining chip, I hope you'll allow me to make you to dinner, to take you to dinner tonight. Here's my card. Bill Kuzmich, crypt analyst. Why, how odd. He looks more like a factory man. Always trying to take advantage of us. In any case, I'm highly intrigued. He's a spy. He's a Russian spy. Later that night. Wow, chicka wow wow. Bill. Well, after that, I never did trust a chimpanzee. I would suppose not, but Bill, you've told me so many fantastic stories tonight, and yet I somehow feel as if I had known very little about you. I could say the same thing. You're gorgeous, new in town, charming. Perhaps you're a spy. Perhaps you're a spy. A spy? That's ridiculous. Prove it. Tell me what you do. I don't really do anything yet. Just yet. I'm newly hired. Go on. If you tell me your secrets, I'll tell you mine. I feel like... Oh, does choices matter in this game? Boom. I guess we'll both have to go sleep unfulfilled tonight. A woman who plays hard to get. I have to respect your fortitude, Omyashka. You are as strong as a Fort Knox, and much more, much more beautiful. Omyashka? What does that mean? That's what I want to know. I think in American English, the only equivalent would be smarty pants. Never mind, you're teasing. I'm in Washington now. I'd be a fool to tell every strange man my business. Ah, so I've been demoted to strange man. <laughs> yes. I never said I didn't like people who were a little bit strange. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Did I say something wrong? No, not at all. You've done everything right. I'd like to see you again. Very much if I could. How bizarre. His entire demeanor shifted in an instant. Now he seems much more like a nervous schoolboy than the suave playboy I thought he was. Well, what do you say? Can I take you on another date? I should think so, but I suppose we'll find out, won't we? Ho 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 ho! <laughs> okay, keep through the- Oh, I'm already good at this. I know what to do. I'm a master at this. Oh, it's fast. Ish. Not fast enough. But yeah, I cannot even like comprehend a French accent. I'm trying to think of like characters I know that had a French accent, or like people, and I just couldn't even think of one. 
at all. Boyka, <laughs> but he's not even really French. Oh, Boyka. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> From uh, what is it, Undisputed 2? God dang. Oh lord. My name is Boyka. Boyka. Swoika Blatt. I know that's a bad word, but that's about all I know. <laughs> I don't even know if that's Russian. I think it's something close to Russian. I'm killing this. But yeah, he's obviously fishing for information out of me, so he's a spy. So. I wonder how many endings this game has, because it seems like there might be like two, like a bad ending and a good ending for this guy. Where probably a bad ending would be giving him information and a good ending would be like staying on my P's and Q's. Or it might not even matter. It might give me the same ending regardless. I don't know. But we're gonna try to get all the endings regardless. Honestly, I think the rhythm is probably the weakest part of this game. I know they're trying to add some, like, spice to a visual novel, but... Okay. Liberals' information on the atomic bomb hits forth enormous... <laughs> enormous... <laughs> is of great value. He and his wife are members of the fellow Countrymen's Association. Though his wife's brother, there is a reliable source of information on enormous... Apart from the data on the atomic mass of the nuclear explosive and on the details of the explosive method of activating it, we would like also like to establish you have decoded the message. Nice. Footnotes. Liberal and his wife are now believed to be Julius and Ethel Rosenberg. Fellow Countrymen Association equals con Communist Party. Oh, we already got them. Thought we already knew they were the bad guys from the start of the game. And that's how I ended up playing tuba at the mayor's birthday. Your stories are truly unbelievable, Bill. Well, they're real. Every single one. I wouldn't lie to you, Francine. I'm Yashka. You seem down in the dumps tonight. He really likes that word. Perhaps a little. Was it the message you decoded today? How's he know I'm a decoder now? Is he watching over my shoulder? Sometimes I forget that he has access to our office space now that's consulting on now that he's consulting on the project. Yes. You can tell me you know. Can I tell you, or will you just report all this back to some Soviet taskmaster? How dare you! This is a preposterous claim! That is absurd! Rid ludicrous! Then why do you peer over my sh our shoulders while we're working all the time? Don't lie to me. You're using me. Using you? Never! You can talk all you want. I know it's true. So, you may as well just stop protesting. Just as I thought. It's not so simple, Umyashka! You are right that I am sympathetic to the communist cause, but... Oh, I knew it. You betrayed me. Please, let me finish. Yes, I am on a covert mission, but I have also fallen for you. I don't des- This happened fast. I don't desire anything from you. I never you need to see any other information the code you break. I just want you in my life. I don't want to lose you. You're a liar. I will tell the truth now. I will tell you everything. Just give me another shot. Oh, you better get talking. <laughs> if he shoots me, I'm gonna be real mad. Dang, we caught him fast, boy. I knew he... It's <laughs> too obvious. It would have been real bad if he's like, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Keep forgetting you have to click that. Oh, it's getting pretty fast here. They'll never be fast enough, though. Yo, never. I do like that it's sped up though, so the message can be decoded faster. Oh, I missed that one. Holy crap, I missed two. Did I? Wow. Tragic. Do, do, do. I like the music. Probably gonna get me copyright claimed, but that's alright. Content ID struck or whatever it is. 
Not a strike, but uh, thing. that's alright. That's alright. Story's been pretty good though, and the grammar's amazing, which is nice for a visual novel game. It's very nice to read. Even though I feel like this is gonna be a very short story. And I don't think there's gonna be too many alternate endings with how it played out, but we'll see. Our compatriot Sensor told his handler that he has access to the work of US cryptanalysis, which would inform us of when or when they were able to break the codes and which agents may be compromised. It would be worthwhile intelligence, but there's some degree that he has a degree. There's some concern that he has a degree of patriotism for his naturalized country. That may be difficult to reconcile with his desire to help us. You have decoded the message. Footnotes. Based on this information, censor could be Bill Kuzmich. I thought so. I knew it. Evil. Bill? Yes, Umanashka. This has been quite the year, hasn't it? This is going so fast. With you, every moment has been heaven. I don't know. I'm trying to get away from the French-ish. I don't know. I don't do accents. But now without his challenges, of course. For which I am deeply sorry. At least, the truth is, no between us now. What is it? What should I choose? Does it matter? Uh... Nothing. Nothing at all. Wait. Uh... I feel like that's the right answer for what I've been choosing. You're funny, you know that? Let's go. We'll be late for the show. Of course, the show. Despite his duplicity, the fact that this may be the last time I'll feel his arm in mine is crushing me. Why? Why? Why is it the last time? Because I thought the, the note said that he was like a good gut. Your tight-lipped nature gave Bill Kuzmich very little to work with, though his position in government circles allowed him to spy on your co-workers, providing limited information about the progress of Project Verona. Kuzmich was identified and suspended due in part to your efforts. I'm the best! but was not publicly prosecuted in order to preserve what was left of Project Verona's secrecy. Someone told you he sells insurance in Iowa now. Good. So, I'm going to play through hers again without the... Well, I don't know, because I'll have to... Because I'll have to play through the same... Is there like a quick skip or something? I don't think so. Alright, we're already past this. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This might be a long video if I play through all the endings. Well, at least I can go through the dialogue pretty quick, but I don't think I can skip over the rhythm parts. I'm gonna do his one more time just because I want to see if the story changes, to be honest. So I can get all the endings for the characters are. I wish I could do this faster. This is the bad part of this being in a visual novel. It's because when I replay through it, I'm going to have to replay through this every freaking time. That's the downside of this. Even though I know it's supposed to add some kind of like joy factor. One, it's not hard enough to add any real entertainment. Even though I think it's a great concept. And two, you can't... The game doesn't realize I've already done this. So it doesn't give me like an option to skip it. Because obviously, the game... I know that this is probably like a super indie game, but just like criticism so that maybe they can work on it in the future or whatnot. But the game should be able to tell that I've already that I can beat this part, so I should be able to skip it. And like this should only reappear in like different parts of the story that I haven't already done. Just to avoid frustration and everything taking forever. But that's just like a, a critique kind of thing. I'm not like super mad about it or anything. It's still a great concept. It's just not executed as well as they could have yet. Oh lord. Maybe I could sk I could skip this in the video. I'll just skip past some things. So, you'll hear this part that I'm talking about here so the creator can know my thoughts on it. But I'm going to skip from now on. Like, I'm going to cut out the parts where I redo the same crypto code. If it's a different crypto code, I'll leave it in. But if it's the same one, I'm just going to skip that. 
Skip that. All other flaws. Skip that. Give me some more. Alright, where's my shoulder grabber? Okay, I'm gonna give him information this time. Yo, homie, you wanna know about the secret project I'm a part of? Yo, Bill! 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 Ah, the crypto guy! <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh. Alright, I'm working on cracking a Soviet code. It seems that we're in the same line of work, then. That's right. It says you're a crypto analyst on your card. Well, that might be overstating things. I'm more of a language advisor. I don't know if you could tell, but I'm Russian, or I was born there anyway. Oh, really? You surprised me. I could have sworn that was a Texan drawl. Well, howdy, ma'am. It's that easy to tell, huh, um, um, um Yashka? <laughs> what does um Yashka mean? Oh, this is the same. Oh, you just wait. I'll find a, a nickname for you, too. Cat got your tongue? No, no, it's just, would you, well, would you like to do this again? I mean, er, would you allow me to take you on another date? He seems generally nervous. I thought he would, was a regular ladies' man, but maybe I'm wrong. I know, just the thing to break the tension. It'll only take a moment to write it out on the scrap of paper. Here's your answer. This is just a piece of paper with nonsense on it. Your business card says you're a crypto analyst, doesn't it? You'll figure it out. Oh man, I got the moves, girl. I like this one a little bit better, actually. To be honest with you. Oh, my hands weren't on the keyboard. Yeah, I still got it, boys. My hand was not even on the keyboard, and I still got it. Can you believe it? Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> do, 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 do. Yeah, it does seem like it's gonna have multiple endings per story. Now the question is, is there two endings per story? Is there three? Because there was three ending choices. There's probably one where he escapes the country, one where he becomes the insurance salesman, there's probably one where we get together and get executed. Living the life, you know? Oh, this message is different. Something to something, there's a bomb. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Who's playing who? Am I playing him or is he playing me? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> oh, here's the ultimate test. What if I hit all the keys at the same time? Does it matter? No, it doesn't. See, that's another thing. There should be like a... If I hit the wrong key, it should make me miss. Just add some challenge to this. But I could literally hit all three keys at the same... All five keys at the same time if I really want to. And I can't miss. Also, there should be multiple colors coming at the same time to make it a little bit more challenging as well. Kind of like, you know, the Undyne fight where you have to fight against your death perception to know which one's going to get there first? There should be something like that. They had some challenge. Uh-oh. I, I thought I hit it, but I guess I didn't. Whoopsie. Toasty. Alright. There was information on... Oh, this is the same. Well, god dang. Well, I'm just going to skip it then. That's fine. Whatever. Cool. Cool. <sighs> and that's how I ended up playing tuba at the mayor's birthday. Your stories are truly unbelievable, Bill. Well, they're real, every single one. I wouldn't lie to you, Francine. Oh, Nyashka, you seem down in the dumps tonight. Perhaps a little. Wasn't the message you decoded today? This seems the same. Is he watching over my shoulder? Sometimes I forget that he has access to our office space now that... Now that's consulting on the project. Yes. You can tell me you know. It was about the couple, the Rosenbergs. Dot dot dot. Do you know them? Uh, yes, I might have met them briefly. Oh dear, I'm sorry if they're your friends. It seems they're providing information to you-know-where about you-know-what. That's terrible. Yes, but at the same time, I feel for them. A couple with children and down to what I've discovered. Who knows what might happen to them? Oh, Yashka, you can't blame yourself. 
You're right, I know, but life is complicated, isn't it? Nothing is as black as white as it used to be. With that, I certainly agree. You give me another one of your funny looks. I'm thinking. About what? Perhaps I'll tell you sooner or later. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, here we go with this thing again. Yeah, I'm ready. Boom. Do 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 Oh. Whoopsie. Ba 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 do 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 oh 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 ha ha dragon skip yay oh, oh that's the fast way to do it oh, I figured it out okay cool you just fail and you get to go faster that's it amazing Bill yes yeah, Omnyashka this has been quite the year hasn't it with you every moment has been heaven. What is it? Bill, you have to leave the country as soon as you can. I know about you. I know you're a spy. I know you may have been trying to use me, and the sad thing is, I don't care. I just want you to be safe. I don't deserve an angel like you, but I can't leave. I can't leave you. Those sort of romantic gestures are no use now. Your life will be ruined. It's not worth it. Please. Omniashka. Oh, Words are not nearly enough to express what I'm feeling. How my heart is bursting inside. Francine, I love you. Uh oh. Alright, let's see what ending we get this time. So I can fail the thing to speed it up. That's kind of cool. I didn't even know that was a thing. With your perhaps unwitting assistance, Bill's Kuzmish was able to provide detailed information about the progress of... Project Verona, allowing the Soviets to uh, alert certain agents that they have been compromised and provide cover for them before they were suspended or prosecuted. Cus Mish now resides in Russia. You wonder if he still adores you, or even, or if he ever did. Sometimes you think you'll always adore him. Despite everything that happened, your mental image is a good one. You see him telling a tall tale and grinning at you. Occasionally, you even hear an Amdiashka echo out from the depths of your memories. This is how you'll remember him. That sucked. The ending sucked. That sucks. I didn't get like a happy, happy ending. I got like a good for Bill ending. God dang. Tragic. Okay. So we know if we fail the thing, we're good to go. That's good to know. Good, good stuff. Okay. So I can speed through this. And I, all the only thing I can really change on the last one with Bill, I'm going to keep all the romantic stuff that Bill liked. And now I'm going to choose the third option, which is, uh, what was the thing? Yeah, it's something. It's not the one where I don't say anything. It's the one where I do something. I'll see if there's three endings or two endings. Pretty much. Yay. Oh, I'm so good at speeding through this. Wow, amazing. I might still play the other ones on the different, uh, like the other characters. Just so I get a full playthrough, but... His, I've already done multiple times. It kind of defeats the purpose of a rhythm thing, though, if you could just kind of skip it. Like, if you don't have to beat it even once, you could just skip it from the get-go. My thing was about skipping it was like if you've already beat it. Not if you've not beat it. You could just kind of cheat it. I like their relationship though when she's giving them all the information. I like their relationship regardless. Our chick's like a player. She's got the she's got the moves. Oh. Yes, I've decoded the message, I guess, not really. Sick. I can't, I swear. Ah, Umniashka, you are the pinnacle of honor. Not always. My dear, we we are in public. My apartment is only a few blocks away. <laughs> I love when he gets flustered. First one back gets a new nickname. <laughs> Interesting. I like that. Yeah. Alright, let's see what we get now, Bill. Bill, 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 Bill. 
Bill. Yes, um, Yashka. This has been quite the year. This is the same. I think we should end things. What? It was fun while it lasted, but I've grown tired of you. I suppose there's nothing more to say. Wait, it's red scene. I can't stop. If I stop, I'll be lured back in. It feels so sudden and strange to walk away, but at least it is final. I'm assuming there's three endings per character. I'm guessing. I don't know. Your tight lip nature gave Bill Kuzmich very little to work with. Uh, though his position in government circles allowed him... Oh, this is the same as the first ending. Yeah, okay. So there's two endings per character. Got it. Sick. I hate how I have to exit every time. Just to get back into it so I can play the other stories. That's alright. Hopefully it's recording all of them. Who knows? Maybe it's like black- Okay, we're- Okay, it's doing it. I was about to say, that would suck. That would suck! Alright, back to- Alright, let's take the chick out now. This is more- uh, more my speed, I think. Hopefully she doesn't have a Russian accent, either. <laughs> That'd be terrible. <laughs> for me. Alright, I'm gonna play through her things too. In just in case it's like maybe more difficult or the same, who knows. Alright girl, why are you tapping on my shoulder for? She looks like, uh, Carmen Sandiego, or whatever that chick's name. Where in the world is Carmen Sandiego? Don't mind me, darling. I'm just returning your scarf. Has anyone ever told you how much you look like Betty Davis? Oh, goodness, no. I don't even know how to do your voice, Francine. The only movie star I've ever been compared to is Humphrey Bogart. My sister... Oh, my sister is Alice. But I think that was just because she was just jealous that the boy she liked asked me to the winter social. Well, I don't know of her, but I'm certain that boy had good taste. Good taste or not, I wasn't interested. Oh really? Why was that? I've just never had much need for boys. Oh ho ho ho! That's just about the most promising thing I've heard all year. What's your name anyway? Francine Pesca. Francine Pesca, lovely to make your acquaintance. I'm Leontine Nuwak. Something tells me you're new here. What brings you to this wretched city? Oh, I'm just a small town girl looking to dance the night away at a big city club with a glamorous lady friend, I hope. That could be arranged. Oh. 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 Dang, I am so fu- I am fierce, boys. <laughs> Making the moves. That was so much fun. I think I nearly wore out my shoes. Well, we had to properly celebrate your mysterious new job. You really aren't going to say more about it, are you? I told you all about me. Diplomat's daughter lived in Germany before the war. Outgoing, vivacious, rarely suffering fools. I forgot one woman advertising company. I just felt like I was being pitched a hot new product just then. And all are perfectly true. So about your job. She wants to know about my job really bad. I'm a number cruncher. It's boring, really. Why do I struggle to believe that? Because in addition to being outgoing, vivacious, and hot-tempered, you're also deeply paranoid? I suppose Washington will do that to you. I wouldn't know. I'm just a small-town girl. Allow me to introduce you to the city. Then, I mean, if you'd like to see me again. Hmm, I don't know. I usually perform women who are a little more outspoken. What? Oh, I see. That was a joke. Thanks, you're sweating crazy. You're going to drive me crazy, aren't you? Uh, here we go. Koton. Let's see if the code's the same. If it's the same, then it doesn't matter, I don't guess. Do, 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 do. I think the music's the same. Yeah, god dang, she can... Our main character protagonist makes moves, especially on women. My god. City, small town girl, my buttocks, boy. She's raring to go. She's like preacher daughter. Do, 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 do. Ah, uh, this one might not change, but the sensor one might change. Possibly. 
do 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 Yeah, this looks the same. It's talking about a bomb. You dropped the bomb on me, and you're turning me out. They're all spies, so that'd be kind of disappointing, honestly. Oh, this might be different. Oh, never mind. No, it's not. It's the same. God dang it. This is so long. Maybe I should just lose. Yeah. Yeah, this is the same. Yeah, same. Maybe hers will change. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to play through it, though, because that just takes so long. It just feels so long after you're already doing it once. So what do you say? Want to come over to my place and listen to a new record? You know, I like listening to music with you very much, but I'm not quite in the mood tonight. Why is that, darling? I was struck by something today at work. Oh, anything I can help with? Why do you want to know? Oh gosh, she's big mad. So you're suspicious of me now? It's confidential for a reason, Leontine. Leontine? Because of a fear of the big bad USSR? Have you ever thought that perhaps the real danger is us? That's a silly question, isn't it? Oh, wait. I'm confused. What's the last one? I think the name's wrong here. Because this should be Francine, right? That's a silly question, isn't it? Of course you have. That's why you're upset. Wait, I'm so confused. No. Oh, never mind. That was right. I just my mind was just messed up. Then you won't mind if I play av devil advocate for a while. Maybe I can provide a different perspective. Oh uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Perspective me. All right. What's to say? Oh, this one didn't decode. Okay. Wait. Did I play through it? I will play through it. Oh yeah, this is different. It seems. Maybe it doesn't decode when you first play through it if you didn't beat it, but you can still skip, so I don't know. I have no idea. Or maybe it would have revealed after I skipped, probably. I don't know. We'll play through it, just to be sure. I'll have to pay more attention next time, see if it actually um, decodes it after you skip. But at least this message is different than the other dudes. At least. Our compatriot Rachel, who once had access to her father's files in Berlin, is now of little use. She is gifted and clever, but requires constant control over her behavior. Claims to be a communist, but in fact she represents American bohemianism at its worst. Loose and ready to sleep with any handsome man or woman. You have decoded the message. Based on the information, Rachel is without a doubt Leontin Nowak, daughter of diplomat Arthur Nowak. Ah, so she wants that action, boy. All right. Leontine. God, she's sweating, boys. Oh no, don't look at me like that. Like what? Like, like you're about to end things. Things are about to end whether, there was no happy ending for this one. Things are about to end whether we like it or not. What do you mean? I decoded a message that points directly at you. Surely I'll be able to talk my way out. I've been in worse scraps than this, and there's my father's position. The government went to to show its hand. Leoten, nothing is guaranteed. Oh God, at least the Soviets will take me in. I've done so much for them. I'm afraid they don't seem too keen on you either lately. Are you kidding? 
Betsy, and you're risking your life to save mine. Don't ever, ever apologize. I wish there was some way I could repay you. What? When did that happen? When did we decide that? Skull. Just promise me you'll think of me when you're sipping a drink on a tropical beach somewhere. With all this far behind you. Oh, darling, I'll never stop thinking about you. I'll bet you say that to all the girls. Well, here's something I don't say out to all the girls. I love you. I always will. Goodbye, Lunatine. Goodbye, Francine. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Okay. <laughs> when did we decide we were saving her? How'd that happen? You told Leotine Nowak nothing about your work, yet she still attempted to sell you on communism. Whether she was successful or not, only you could say. Nowak now resides in Cuba, where she landed after being denied Soviet citizenship. She believes she owes her life to you, and who are you to argue? Maybe your past will cross again one day, but probably not. Still, you look back on your affair f if only. Wow, we just don't get with anybody, apparently. We're just doomed. <laughs> but yeah, she didn't have like a... Like a... I don't know. She, it didn't seem like there was any way that she was going to have a happy ending. We'll try it again to see what she's got on the other ending, but she only had two choices. Yeah, okay, so it doesn't reveal until you hit skip. Yay. Alright, who just tapped on my shoulder? Let's check again. I can tell you I'm a code breaker. You go most fascinating by the second. So the Russians then, I imagine that's the country whose codes you're trying to break. I'm not a fool, is that what you thought? That I'm a privileged young lady with no sense of world politics? No, not at all. Forget I said anything. Anyhow, my mind is in a fog. That scene? Yes. I'm sorry for snapping at you like that. You can speak any way you like. It's a free country. Well, yes, but... I'm sure I'll see you around sometime. I must get going. Hold on, will you? My word. You're going to challenge me, aren't you? What I've been trying to do, rather clumsily perhaps, is get to know you, because I think you're the most interesting person I've met in a long hold. Long while. And I'd like to spend more time with you in the future. Is that so? Hmm. Seriously, you're killing me. Alright. Alright? Yes, I'd like to see more of you. Good night, then. Betsy and Pesca, you'll be the death of me. I can already tell. Alright. Huh. Sure. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Dewey. Uh, new record thing. There's this couple. Yes. They may have a sudden fall for grace, perhaps deservedly so, but ju it just makes me think about their children, really. What will happen to them? So they've been compromised? Hold on. You're trying to ask me if I'm a spy too, like them. My god, I'm such a fool. I just thought you had certain sympathies, but I didn't. I hope this says is a valuable lesson for you, darling. But, were you just using me? Francine, I haven't been have I've been having a wonder uh, I've been having a legit legit oh, legitimately wonderful time with you. Have I badgered you with questions about your job? Well, no. Am I being honest with you right now? Well, yes. Even though it could sink me deeply into trouble, I suppose so. Well, then, if anyone has a reason to be upset, it's me. Now I know something I shouldn't. The, the question is what to do next for both of us. Oh dear, what a fool I am. The brilliant ones are often are, I've noticed. Come, let's discuss. Oh my god, so she's just evil. This chick's just evil. She just sucks. Oh, I hate her. She's the worst. I like Bill better. God, I like Bill a whole lot better. Leontine, 
Oh, okay, here we go. You're quick, I'll tell you that much. Darling, I was only joking. I can't do this anymore. Is it because of my affiliations? That you want to be with me, but you're not brave enough, is that it? If you say things that way, I think this really is for the best. I think I misread you all this time. I thought you were someone special, someone strong. Someone who wasn't a, just a mis mindless drone. Don't you walk away from me, I'm not done yet. You're certainly making this decision easier for me. But in this moment, it still just feels like a thousand pieces of glass rushing into my heart. I have to remember this is for the best. Alright, well we got this done. Alright. One person story. You aided the communist cause by perhaps unwittingly helping Le Leontino walk. Alert the Soviets that the Rosenbergs and others were compromised. Allowing Russia a head start on protecting their spies and allies. Nowak was taken by surprise when the government identified her as a spy and the Soviets offered no help. She was prosecuted and sentenced to imprisonment. Though her family's wealth and privilege helped shorten the time she spent behind bars. And she eventually landed in Prague, when, where she reportedly lives, leads a lonely life. You try not to think about her suffering. You try to think of only the good times. Despite everything, it was a passionate romance. Perhaps even worth the trouble. Alright. So even though she got what she wanted, she got screwed harder in that ending. Yeah, she's just kind of evil, dude. Alright, let's play the last one. Last two. Probably two endings for everybody. Alright. Woo, 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 woo. Hot dog. <laughs> Here I am, the big city. Yeah, skip. I've decoded the message. Again. For the fifth time. Hi, glasses. What's up? Hello, ma'am. Is this your scarf? Or maybe it's just a scarf that fell on the ground a long while ago. And you just happen to be stepping over it at this exact moment. Oh no, it's mine. Thank you. I'm glad to hear that. Just the other day, I was at that big White House over there. Well, I suppose it's the White House, and the Secretary of State had dropped some important papers on the ground. But I didn't know they were his papers at first, so I was walking around saying, Hey, did anyone drop these papers? And well, he wasn't too happy with that. But I explained, and... Oh, shoot. What's wrong? I'm talking too much again. I, it's in my nature. I grew up on a dairy farm in Michigan, and I guess I just got used to telling the cows whatever was on my mind. That's all right with me. I've just come in from Pennsylvania. Uh, just come in from a small town in Pennsylvania. Myself and my sister say I'm much better at talking than working. It seems like we have a lot in common. Say, would you like to join me, you know, for a drink or something to eat? Unless you're busy. You're probably busy. I'm starved. Let's go. This is one of the strangest men I've ever met, but I find myself very intrigued by him. You find yourself intrigued with everyone. Now, let's be honest, Francine. God dang. Miss Beatty Davis. Later that night. I can't believe I came all the way to Washington to talk about raising cows. Although, as far as farm farmhands go, you're quite charming. Now you've got me blushing. But I can find other topics of conversation too. Topics more suited to a date. I mean, if you consider this to be a date. <laughs> I'd say it was one of the best dates I've been on in a long while. Golly, <laughs> I could tell you how hard my heart is jackhammering right now. I really err so topics of conversation. Hmm. Jobs? We could talk, tell each other about our work. You first. Simple, I'm an assistant to the economic advisor to the president. His name is Laird McDermott, a very knowledgeable man and a great leader to boot. Goodness, that sounds so important. I know, I can't believe I have that position. I mean, I did go to school for this. But still, anyhow, what brings you to the city? 
<sighs> I have a job as a bookkeeper. It's certainly not as interesting as your position, but I have a love for numbers. Marvelous. Perhaps you could help me then. I'm terrible with my books. But you're an economist. Yes, but a terribly disorganized one, I'm afraid. You're an enigma, you know. I am? I don't mean to be. I'd like to be an open book, especially to you. Would you like to go, uh, pick this up another time, maybe? This is... that is, go on another date? Absolutely, you're an open book. I'd love to keep reading. That's about the nicest thing someone has ever said to me. Oh. Da 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 da. Enormous! The bomb! Wow, that bomb is enormous. Would you like to some ice cream? I'm not hungry, thank you. Not really. Oh, I get it. You want to go dancing even though I've got two left feet. That's very sweet of you, but I don't want to go dancing. Well, I'll be. I've never seen you so bent out of shape that you didn't want to go dancing before. What's wrong? I feel a bit distressed by my work sometimes. Why would that be? I suppose I just feel the res stress and responsibility on my shoulders. That's understandable. A lot rests on proper accounting. I think it's wonderful of you to take your job so seriously. You're so thoughtful, Ted. I'm glad you think so, but I think that pep talk and the idea of a nut hamburger are the last two things for, uh, rattling around in this old noggin. Then there's not a moment to spare. Let's head to dinner. I think I like this storyline the best, to be honest. Alright, let's figure out about old Tad now. Uncle is recommended for a bonus for his well covered cover his well considered cover story. In his last conversation with Courier, he discussed his proximity to Capitan. He was work at the bank and his desire to be of service. You have decoded the message. Footnotes Capitan, the bank, the US Department. Uncle likely refers to Laird McDermott. Ah. Oh, so I guess he's just a good guy, I think. Our first good guy. Great. Well, how do you like the symposium? It was quite informative. It's just that... A mathematics symposium isn't quite right for a date. Gosh, I always seem to mess this up, these up. No, it's perfect. Perhaps a little dry, but I appreciate the thought. I'm pleased to something something. I'm not always... I may not always succeed, but gosh darn it, I'm trying. Listen, Ted. Oh, is this boss a bad guy? Let's get ice cream. Music to my ears. Oh, so his boss is a bad guy. It's a perfect way to end a nice long day of hard mathematics. Well, if you don't stop teasing me about this, I'm very easily brought to tears. You know that. Oh, Ted. Roll will eat you alive if you're not careful. Yeah, I think it... Okay, so he's just an un... Like... Unwitting. You did not tell Gallagher that his boss... Oh, Ted Gallagher? Was a Soviet spy, though it weighed heavily on you. The secrecy in your relationship began to take a toll, and before too long you grew distant from each other and split up. Subsequently, Ted's career was marred by his defense of McDermott before accepting the truth. In a long time connection to the convicted spy, your career, however, progressed well. After Project Vona was shut down, you were moved on to several other Krypton analyst projects that were secret to this day. Well, at least I was on a come up, I guess, but Ted got screwed. Poor Ted. Rest in peace. Alright, let's get the other ending. I'm not going to play through it three times, even though I saw there were three options. Because it seems to go to the same second ending, so I'm just going to do that. I will read that line I missed, though, on that first playthrough of Ted's thing. No. Alright. The Red Menace is real. If an A-bomb falls. Ta 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 ta. New sliders. They did do a good job on, like, the art and everything, but... I don't know. This game hasn't really kept my interest a whole lot. The rhythm wasn't executed very well. Um... And, I don't know, the story plot just doesn't grip me too much. Like, none of the characters I really care about too much. It's kind of... It's, it's a little bit too short, I think. 
Well, not even short. I guess the subject matter just doesn't appeal to me. I don't know. And I don't care about the characters. I just don't. I don't think there's... Ted was on it, I guess. Alright. I'm a code breaker. A code breaker? What code are you trying to break? Well, surely you might must know if you're so high up at the White House. Surely. But I admit, I don't. Perhaps you've never seen the messages themselves, but you know of the project cracking the Soviets' one-time pad codes? I must say, it's news to me. God, he's so unaware. But it sounds well worth it. Seems to me like you're doing our country a great service. And very pretty. I missed something. God dang, I hit the inner key too many times. I'm sorry, that was too forward. Would you like to go out with me again? I promise I'll be better prepared next time. Better conversation topics and everything. Alright then, but only if the conversation topics are the tops. I guarantee it. Oh no, a sure sign of love sickness. I feel as if my feet are about to hover right off the ground. Yeah, the inner key is not the best for things. But, time. It's alright. Skip. Boom. Yay. Alright, what you got? No, I don't want ice cream. I want to tell you about the two people about to be arrested. Say some spies are revealed. They've been instrumental in providing secrets about the atomic bomb. But they're also a couple. They have children, and perhaps they thought they were doing the right thing. I say they should be shot or go to jail. Goodness. But don't you see? There's no other way. People like that cause a sickness in our society. It doesn't make me glad to see people punished, but it's only fair. Well, now I'm steamed. Yeah, he got dark all of a sudden. Dean, why is that? Why, what's made you so mad? I'm just fuming over the capacity of the world to vex this lovely lady on my arm. Oh, Ted, you really do care, don't you? No, I'm not being sweet, Fran. I'm angry and extremely tough. <laughs> I'd go five rounds with the heavyweight champ right now. I just hope I haven't said too much. Yeah, Ted is very, uh, what is it? Um, naive person. Oh, but he got real mad. They do a good job with the facial expressions of the characters. Well, how do you like the symposium? It's quite informative, it's just that... A mathematics symposium is... Oh, I've already read this. Don't to something perfect, I aim to please. That's what it was. There's something you should you need to know about your boss. I shouldn't be saying this, but Laird McDermott's name came up at work. Your boss is working with the Russians, Ted. That's impossible. How did you come to this absurd conclusion? We decrypted some documents, and though some analysis found out that the, the spy the documents referencing is very likely him. Are you alright? Please talk to me. I need to give him a chance to explain. It can't be true, but if it is, the president needs to know. No, Ted, you can't tell anyone. Not even the president knows about the project. If you start running your mouth, the cover will be blown. Chaos will erupt, and I'll be take the blame. Sabotage, sneaking, Francine, I didn't sign up to be a spy. Perhaps you can live your life this way, with shadows and secrets and whispers, but I can't. I won't. You can't possibly be willing to betray your country and me in one fell swoop. I don't consider betrayal, I consider it the pursuit of truth. If that's really your decision, then I don't think we have anything to s else to say to each other. No, I don't suppose we do. Oh. Well, that wasn't a good ending. There is no good ending, bro. We're just screwed. Your admission to Ted Gallagher that his boss was a Soviet spy brought grave repercussions. Ted immediately confronted his boss, alerting the Soviets that there was a weakness in their encrypted correspondence for the years previous. 
Russia alerted many of its spies, helping them to avoid prosecution. The White House also became aware of Project Verona. Ted refused to mention her name, and you've managed to keep your job, but nasty gossip came, ran rampant through your department. Ted's career suffered at first, but as the truth came to light, his brash honesty was seen in a patriotic light, putting him on a course for a successful career with the State Department. You do not speak. Well, good for Ted. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna play through that again, because the other option was just to break up with him, which was the other ending anyways. Uh, yeah, I'd give this game about 6 out of 10. It's, it's pretty well made. I like the art style a lot. I don't think the subject matters, matters like super entertaining. It's a little bit too historical for me, which uh, that didn't really play into the rating. It was more that I just didn't really care about the characters. And like none of the endings were a good ending. There was like no real good ending or there was no like build up with cohesion between the stories. Like every story just kind of had like a similar but different outcome for the different characters that I don't care about. Instead of like discovering more about the story and like, progressing to like the tr one true ending which is why i usually like invisible novels when you go through the different paths that they culminate into like a larger story or a larger ending or something this doesn't really do that but it's not a bad game i do like that they tried to implement the rhythm but they could have done it better because it was just kind of bland and honestly i'd rather just skip through it because it's not hard um there's no challenge to it but yeah thanks for watching as always guys i hope you enjoyed the video